was worth waiting for the heavy metal explosion, and 80,000 fans were happy to be hit by the shrapnel. Say live and let die. Dosage will be just as heavy in Melbourne tonight, but police in Victoria can take heart. If Sydney has been any indication, it won't be an overdose. Adam Morvis for 11 a.m. Fans of the band labelled the biggest hard rockers in the world, it was everything they'd dreamt and more. At the biggest gig Australia has ever seen, it was well worth a wait extended by 45 minutes, the Gunners living up to their reputation for being late on stage. The only ones who failed to meet expectations, the fans themselves. In a crowd of more than 80,000, there were only four arrests. During the show, the first aid centre treated less than 50 people for minor complaints. Dawn revealed surprisingly little damage and few sore heads. Tracy Spicer has this report. <laughs> at the tamest rock concert in Australia's history and the fans oh. are on stage just before nine delayed by an hour because of a fire in a speaker tower this is what Guns N' Roses fans came to see Axl Rose and Co strumming their stuff in a three hour show of ear splitting sound and pyrotechnics <laughs> Fireworks display ended the...